Hello everyone, this is Ares Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Legendary Choice of Copy Let's Play. We continue for episode 9 from the summer season of 1570. So we ran into a big problem around Nagato last time, and it's going to cause a lot of issues. We can get our Daimyo back, we can ship him off with the Navy, and it shouldn't be too bad. My problem is I don't want Hojo to take Nagato, so we're going to have to take some risky, risky maneuvers against their stack here with our... Agents, we have to try to sabotage him so he doesn't go. So that would work. That means we have a chance in Nagato with our secondary army. Our Daimyo is going to come back, hop on a ship. That's the fastest way we can get through this forest and back to our area. We are also going to freeze this army in place. Let's give him some experience. And perhaps we can kill off some of their agents here. No. Very difficult. Not worth it. We'll still freeze them. We're going to send our reserve stack here. And we can land and take Sono before anyone else takes it. Our agent can pop off. Get these ships in here. Right, our ships are fine. We're building a new stack here. And we're bringing this group to meet them. So they have 10 here as well. Plenty of ships ready, plenty of trade ships ready. We'll leave that alone. Now, what's most likely going to happen is that we probably won't fight Hojo, which is why we're so keen on grabbing this before they do. We're going to at least siege it so that we get the shot at it. And this new army can help us afterwards. Uh, we'll take our Daimyo back. He can heal up here. I'm going to spend the money on the castle upgrade so that we can get three recruitment slots. He's going to get two more bow warrior. Uh, so he have what, seven? Five. We can borrow the two over there. And then we're going to spam recruit bow samurai instead of the Daikyu because they're one turn now. And they're technically better at this point with all the upgrades um, and definitely cheaper for a certain degree. I mean, much cheaper than Bow Warrior Monk. We might squeeze one more in. We'll see how things goes. We're also pumping out units back here. I think we'll keep that up. We're going to need to replace a few things and also... Let's see, we just want them to get over here. And with what little money we have left, we're going to get three more of them. Yeah, we lost a good chunk of our front line as well. Okay. They're all recruiting. They have eight. Full stack. They're coming in with an army. It's a small force. We can let it go through. I mean, we're not going to fight Takate right now. But eventually... I'm going to bring this fleet back. We can meet together. We're going to just control this point. That should be enough for now. This fleet still needs two more ships, but we'll find a place for them. And we technically have a lot over here. We're kind of overloaded. Hmm, we should be okay. Now the monks that we have need to be shifted up as well. Because I think religion's not really going to be an issue going forward. Yeah, Nye Happiness, he's counting for four of that, so he should move out. And he can minister along the way for experience. And we're going to move forward because we want to take care of the settlements that we will take over. And then we can move the army out without causing any issues. And plus, the monks are really good at taking out enemy agents. Probably Matsuke in particular, better than our... Ninjas at uh, that job, converting characters. So we'll try to do that. I think all the religion issues are solved. Uh, these two fleets, I think we're going to send them this way instead. 
We're not going to recruit any more here. I'm going to send these four over here. And then we're going to maybe build a few more here. Because two might not be enough here. So we can get another two sets of uh, army set up. That should do it for now. And let's continue. Unless there's any offers. We could probably sell them some military access. To receive you. It is always a I day don't need to be to in his territory right now. Let me offer five turns, see what he's willing to pay for that. Oh, he's not willing to pay for that. That is unfortunate. I guess since we don't have any land here, once we have land, he might buy military access. All right, we'll see how things goes. We stall that army, so this should be safe. We're protecting Atakiyama so that we are the ones wiping them out. Now, I'm not that comfortable using that army there, the small one, to take the settlement, given that they might have another ambush army. So we'll try to stall the Hojo forces one more time. If we have trouble stalling them, then we're probably going to have to pull the trigger. Yeah, they have the full stack there. We have to probably pull the trigger and... Ooh. Rival clan suffering. Right, we can help and increase our honor. We have pretty high honor. We technically don't need this. Hmm. We already have enough honor for the happiness bonus. So I'm not really sure about this. Yeah, I'm going to ignore it. We need the money. It's a decent sized force. We might have to stall them. We have to at least stall the big one, which is difficult because they have triple Matsuke here. If we siege and they come out and attack with this force, I think we lose, which is not what we want. We take this first. Super easy. Ah, Sun's also born. We have an heir now. Doesn't have to go to our brother. Uh, two daughters before that. That's fine. No big deal. Hmm. Well, the monks come here. Well, actually... We could send the monks over here to target the agents. Since we can dump the three monks from over there over here. They can't move this turn anyways. Actually, we can. We can leave the unhappiness around for a turn. It wouldn't hurt us. Yeah, they're all going to come out. Uh, let's dump our guys back home. They will actually replenish pretty fast, despite the injury that they took. And we're going to go cheap. Actually, we'll have a front line of what? Eight units of Yari Ashigari, two, so that's ten. Fifteen. We can borrow that ninja right now. 16, 4 slots, 5 turn for the recruitment upkeep. Yeah, let's get 4 of them. It's just going to be so much faster for us to get them ready. Alright, we'll dump him as well. This fleet can now return here. We can move him into here and bring him over here. This fleet, we still need to go control these two ships. Join them. Still missing two ships. Let's get them recruited. This is to create another army. 
one without a general for now, but uh, we still need to produce more units. What we have is not enough, especially after getting attacked like that. Uh, we can take the risk here. This should be a free experience. Actually, 63. That's a decent percentage. We should try to stall him. 58%. It is not likely. Also going to be very expensive. Can they hold this when they come attacking? What if we just isolate this group so they can't work together? Because this doesn't look great. Uh, they might take it, actually. Okay, I know I want to stop this. This I, I don't want them to go. 56%. I kind of don't want to lose a max level ninja, so I'm going to send him in. Lovely. We did it. So, they survive. We'll send this army out. And we'll go together. I think we can spend all the money on the sabotage. Alright, keep them. No more ambushes against us. A uh, little bit of scouting. This way we can still take Nagato, which would be very lovely, because we can shift this point up then. We don't have to guard here, even though we do need to take the choke. But we have a ship that can do that, so we can shift both of these up much farther. Uh, later. Let's finish the fight here first. We can go into the settlement for now. I believe we do replenish faster or slower? 29 per turn. Same thing, so we'll stay outside then. Okay, so that's all taken care of. We don't have enough money for more ships, but that's decent for now. They're missing two ships, which are coming from here. They're done. Still have a fleet coming up. And then we need to build four more ships here, which costs about a thousand and change. We should be fine. Trying to ship this guy, join the main force here. Yeah, no problem. Ooh. Consider my words with care, and likewise your response. I'm I'm okay with this, especially if they pay us. About 1,200, maybe? I'm already trading, so whatever this is, it's just extra. We'll let Realm Divided break this naturally. So we're allies with him, but we're not allies with Takade, and he's still allies with Takade. I suspect Takade will declare war on us after they wipe out Atari over there, because they're just going to run out of targets. They're, I think they're done with Mogami. Oh, Hatari lost the piece of land there. So they have one last piece. I think Takata's going to finish that, and then they're going to come after us. Just naturally. You know, we're the only faction left. Okay, so Mogami still has a piece of land. There we go. They plan to invade us. We can stack this. No, I don't care about that, because once we faction wipe, it's over. I think we can fight this. We have enough range to kind of outshoot these four. And then everyone else would be easy pickings after that. 
We don't have that many bow units, so we do have to eventually go inside. I wonder what the... Hold on, let's just continue this for a minute. They won't fight us. Um, Takate forces, we have to kind of track them now. We also have an opportunity to take this. I am pretty sure they have this, since they own all of this. Even if they didn't have it, they have it now. I can see the line. So we can technically take another trade note and push this up quite far. So we have to send our fleets up. They can hold the point still. The Kade will come from over here. Take us. Oh, they're here already. They're Daimyo. Yushinobu Takade. They're closer than we think. Okay. We're going to hold their army just there for now. Anyone coming from the southern flank? I doubt it because this path doesn't meet until like here. So once they wipe out Hatari, maybe they walk down the southern uh, route. But before that, they can't. So we go here. I'm going to move behind them. And I just want to see what else is going on here. Oh, they have another stack. Ah, can we reach him? Percentage is not high, but we'll take the shot. This is probably one of our better assassination characters. Not the best. The best is the one that we just shipped over. We could use our monks as well. Oh, this fail scene is going to be really funny if we do fail here. It's going to slide down. His sword's going to fall off. Oh no, we got this. We got this. Beautiful. 54% and he's dead. Beautiful. And then he can get experience off of this group later, even though I think they're going to merge right there. All right, let's see what our chance for the monk for the conversion. 45% chance, pretty low. I think it's going to be the same. It's going to be free though. Maybe we can practice on him. Yeah, 90%. Let's do it. Get some experience there. Happiness, converting character, converting province, that's what we want. And we're gonna convert character here. He's gonna be better at it next turn. Can we get a free demoralize? Failed, didn't die, that's the important part. We're gonna just keep them hanging over here. Don't use your agents on us. I, I don't think he... I mean, he hasn't done anything like that. So I don't expect him to do anything like that. Two more. Yep. That would fail this army. Come dump another group here. Join the force. Those three that's on its way, where are they? Alright, so 10, 8, 10, 9, plus 1. Yeah, we'll have a full army by next turn. Uh, you guys are a good amount to follow them. They are missing, what, two ships? Okay, so they will have them soon. Um, I might need to move forward. Is there any spot we can land and attack Takate from here? We could get some sort of military access with Hojo and land here and attack them at Imasaka. We need to hit these ships. Okay, we're together, so that's fine. They're missing these. We need to spend money on them. We also need to spend money on our newly Conquer territory, so at least a fix here. Want the farm. It's barren soil, but we want the food. We want the global food supply increase. Trade port, we do want that as well. No money. It's going to be a cavalry recruitment center. I think we'll keep it as that. Alright, units are up. Uh, where's our trade ship stack? Let's start sending them this way. 
because I think the first node we can take is not the Hojo node, but it's this node right here. We can travel with these three and take control of that. Here, I think we're going to... Uh, is Hojo going to join the war with Takate? That's the big question. If they are, then we, we can jump on it. But if they're not, then we don't know what we're going to do. We're not going to produce any more trade ships because we don't know if we can take any nodes and just might be very extra if we built them. Can't really protect them and they're going to cost a bunch. Um, if we're doing like backup armies, I think we'll do like six of them plus 14 archers. And then we can just supplement units in as armies die out in the front. They need a lot of archers too. We just didn't have time to recruit. More are coming though, so we should be good. Alright, so let's fight this. I think we want to fight this on the map. Or maybe not. Like we'll have... We're gonna run out of ammo here for sure. We snipe them. We pick off the expensive units. If we ran out of ammo with double the amount, well, actually six extra archer unit, I think, last time. So I'm worried that we'll just run out of ammo here. And then the fighting on the climb. Yeah, I'll just take this auto resolve here. Yeah, we don't lose much. It's very spread. You will be healed in a turn. Uh, didn't we? Oh, we had to target their clan. We targeted some other armies. That's fine. I'm not going to use this as a recruitment site, so this is going to go. Yeah, there's no resources here. We'll do a sake den and market plus a temple. All right, we don't need to blockade here anymore. Do they need help with the Takate ships? Maybe. Maybe we need to track them. We'll shadow them. This one right here, it's ready kind of shadowing them. Do they have more coming? They do have more coming. It's okay, we have a backup fleet here that should grow in size very soon. It should be up to eight ships in two turns. I can queue this up ahead of time. We have a little bit of money left. All right, that went well. We got the two territories that we wanted and maybe we can use our monks to incite violence or rebellion here. But with both of these armies still here, we can't do much. But we did find them. Alright, just depends on when Takare wants to actually declare war on us. Maybe this turn. The warning usually comes right before. Yeah, they... Oh, Hatari got wiped by Hojo. Okay, I mean, it doesn't matter. That means they're stuck on the north coast, because I think the road goes through that province to go down. And I guess we get to focus on the north coast for a little bit, even though... Ideally, I want to take control of this, the inner sea, so we don't have to get any... naval incursions coming to our home island. Our brother comes of age, back at home. And we get plus more recruitment slot. That is actually very helpful. Let's get our brother just to chill. Oh, we might have a few level up all, all across that we have been missing. He's going to get the town, get that one. Yep, he's only 14. Wow, coming of age quickly. And all those ships are gone. It's okay, we're not going to go chase blindly, especially since they're not declaring war on us just yet. I think it's because we slow down their uh, main army. If they were in position, they probably do declare war on us. Flood this with the monks. Oh, he is good at converting character, right? Can we get rid of this, uh, Matsuki? Nope. I think we let him through. Like, what's he gonna do? Well, actually, we trap him here and then we go around and attack him behind. Right? We can declare war on him anytime. They have more coming, but not much. Yeah, this is where the road goes down to the south side of Hansho. So they're stuck on the north side. 
Uh, pick up some experience off of him. Failed. Can we kill his agent? 51%. He is our best assassin, so if he can't do it, I say we don't risk it. This is a full stack, right? 8, 8, 16, 2, 2, yeah, except for he's going to die eventually and we're going to be missing a unit. Alright, pick up these boys and then Daimyo can take a ship actually. Perfect location. Full stack. I'm supposed to be safeguarding this. <laughs> How do you feel about taking a trade ship? Because they're going to follow them behind. I can dump our daimyo behind the enemy lines at Izumo. It would be a little bit risky. 900 to keep him here. Yeah, let's keep him here. Failed. Get behind him. Very expensive to keep him here. We need to make sure no one gets close to this, right? We gotta stop all of them from getting here so that our Daimyo has a chance. And then we're gonna blockade this port. We're gonna leave their armies alone so they can leave. Are the Hojos even fighting anyone? Ah. Oma. Shouldn't they hop on a boat and go there? Oh, we can trade with them. They are loaded. I will listen attentively. 577. Your fair I think we can get at least 5,000. Yep. Because they've been stashing cash since the first turn. They just have gold mine right there. Let's see how, how much money we can get. Not 7,500. Maybe something like this. 7. Two, seven, three. Let's do seven, four. Okay, it's seven, two, something. I mean, we want as much as possible. We're going to need this to build out the new provinces we picked up. Ah, uh, super stingy. Military access, we just have to go through one province. He's not fighting us yet. I expect him to. I guess we can ask for the access after they do declare war against us, even though they might drag Hojo in together. But I guess we wouldn't mind that so much at this point. If Hojo declare war on us, we need this army to land. I need this army to hold this point, so that's why the Daimyo is going to ride the trade ships. Alright, we still have one army missing a ton of archers. Um, at least six. I think exactly six, right? 10, 11, 12. Oh, actually, he's missing eight unit slots. Right? That's seven, nine, 11, 12. Yep. Eight archers might be too many. We get extra recruitment slot all across the board, and they will also get this. Uh, do I want to get like four of these? I think I do. We'll do 10 and 10. And just follow the main army around. I'm not recruiting anything at home. I'm going to count our naval powers to uh, protect us. He's going to hover in case... We have some Takata landing somehow. 
That would be very awkward. I, I hope that's not the case. Alright, that's for happiness. That's for... Oh, fertile. That's not so bad. We do need this upgraded. We need this upgraded. They upgraded the horse for us, which is great. Triple monk. Are they going to have to stay until we build... Actually, we can't build any um, typical happiness building like a sake den or, or a monastery. We have to build a Yari drill yard because I want to get better cavalry units. Yeah, this is going to be a military. This is going to be pricey to get this set up. But I guess we have to do it. Um, what do we do with these armies? I think we stay. We're, we're freezing them. Daimu is moving forward. We buy military access. We want them to declare war. That's what we're waiting for. Do we have anywhere to spend this last 2,000? Yes, we do. That's good enough. If Takate declare war, seems like they have a string of ships on the south coast. We have three stacks in three turns. Should be okay. They haven't declared war on us. That's the awkward part. I want them to do it. If they want to exploit our situation, please do so quickly. Yeah, I don't I don't hear anything from them. A peep. Ooh, no, don't need to see the trade ship. <laughs> this feels so unsafe. Let's uh escort our daimyo here. We can technically ship hop. Wait, I think there's a way for us to hop ships. Yeah. We feel a little better now. And yeah, we can we can go ahead. The trade ship can lag behind by themselves. Um, easy experience on this guy. Yeah, let's do it. Because our army's going to be here. We're going to just train our characters here real quick. Clicking this guy. We might have more than a few level ups, uh, including our Matsukis, which we didn't look at. So we'll take quickly take a look at everyone. Max level, don't let him get over there. Failed. Backup plan. Um, let him move. Because I think the reason why they're not declaring us is he's not moving. And it's very expensive to keep him still. So we'll rather isolate him by himself here. And we can look closer to the landing. Alright, they're not leveled up. They're not leveled up. Ah, he's leveled up. Yeah, these three are together. Yeah, so we're good. Agents are all good. Created three. Let's do three more. Very pricey. They need that force. How do we get it to them? Probably through the harbor. Keep them on the south end of things. Give them six archers, and then we'll give them two cavalry units later on. They'll hold up on the south side of things. Actually, be outside. Do we need the army for the happiness? Or else we can go outside too? 15. We do need them. So, uh... I can move the general, I guess. Oh, actually, he can pick up a bad trait. I don't care. He's gonna die of old age. Not a big deal. Send them over. Send them over. Alright, we're done recruiting... Yariyashigaris for a while.
Yeah, I mean, Takate warned us. I, I appreciate it if they actually declare war. We are ready to go for that war. We should track the ships. At least sent one. There's more coming, but we probably want to stick together. Alright, we won't spend anything on the remaining... Uh, on the ships. We should be fine. Save some money. Let's see if anything else needs to be upgraded, especially these three. That's where we're printing most of our cash. Alright, seems like we're good. Uh, we can start walking them over. We can actually save some money. If only Hojo and Takade would break their alliance, that would be magical. Start fighting each other because there's just no one else to fight. If Hojo moves most of their forces back, which is kind of what they're doing right now, we could try to incite a rebellion here. Oh, they have more coming. Oh, he's moving. He's moving forward. Wait, wait, wait. Forward or back? Not sure. There's a lot of Takate fleets just kind of around our area. All right, we're going to try to get this done. He's moving forward. Okay. 32%, 38%. I'm going to take... Uh, well, they're allies, and he's not gone. Do we want to declare war on them? We can freeze both of this army. We can take control of the port. Land our Daimyo's army here. And then send the fleet to attack that node. It's war horses from what I remember. It's not very lucrative, but still something. If Hojo gets dragged into the war, we will be very screwed. So it's better if he declares. We're we're both in this like we're both allies with Hojo, but I think he Hojo's gonna stick with them. Which is not great for us. But he might not join the war against us, because we he still likes us. That's what we have to count on. I mean I can slowly build this up in the meantime. Alright, we can spend this. If Hojo goes to war with us, we take all their points out west as well. That that would be a big win for us in terms of money. Don't like that, but we do have this fleet, and we can use this to take Aki real quick. Do, should we even bother with inciting? It's very low chance. It, it we'll get a gold out of it, but we'll basically spawn Rebel Army, and then they will just kill it. They can't move. We gotta hold them. Okay, so that's good. And he maxed out. Excellent. So we have four max ninjas right now? I don't need to see too far ahead. Right, we just need one person to do that. Ooh, sending agents out at us, huh? 1v1, let's go. I mean, I think we could declare on Takata. Or Takata. Oh, that's the fail. Ah, 73%. Shame. Now we're in danger if he tries to apprehend us next turn. Hmm, bummer. Come back a little. We need you. Yeah, 
this is just free experience. Detect ninjas, line of sight, very similar things. Like, we're not scared of this stack. It's not that good. Us in a defensive position with a full stack. And then more coming. I'm just worried about Hojo getting dragged into all this. We can take out that fleet with this. I can potentially take out that fleet with this. This fleet shouldn't be enough to threaten this. Especially with more coming next turn. So if we just turn on them this turn and do a landing here, not the worst idea in the world. We do have a trade agreement, so that that makes it a little difficult. My horse needs exercise, so be quick. Ah, I'm gonna wait a turn. Everything still feels a little out of position. And maybe he declares on us. That would be the best. As he moves his Daimyo's army closer and closer. Oh my god, Hojo has so many ships. Let's say it's like six per fleet. Like, that's a decent average. There's at least eight of them here, so that's like 48 ships. Oh, he's moving ahead to target someone else. That's slow mo. Are we still alive? We're still alive. He went south. Okay. I don't think he's going to make a move on us, despite what they say. Okay. Mogami's dead. They're, they have no enemies. It's basically three clan. Homa, uh, Homa's still alive, but in spirit only at this point. I need I need vision. Where did that stack go? Ambush? Went back? Try to go back? I don't want them here. They could hop onto a ship. Right? They could hop on a ship that, that's been setting up and leave and attack our main island. So we gotta freeze them. Get this army ready. And we need to bring them over, basically. Fiery drill yard. Oh, what do we want here? Probably just sake den for happiness. Because we're going to eventually... Are we eventually going to get... We'll get silk. Once we get silk, we can build this. The other alternative is just a cheap market. But level 1 market is only 200. It's 5 growth. That's the big thing. If we ever increase our tax, that's going to be what carries us. Build one and forget about it. Build one and keep upgrading. If we upgrade once, we have 200, which matches the market. Get happiness, which we don't technically need here. Eventually, it can be, what, 350? After three upgrades, though. So I think we'll just go market here. We have all the buildings we need for the recruitment part, so we don't need to do anything there. Yeah, this fleet is ready now. I feel like they're coming here to pick him up. I mean, given their fleet strength, we could let them pick it up and then we can just sink them. If 
Free experience, can't say no. We're in an awkward situation. He needs to die. I don't think we have any choice here. 73, that might be the highest. 71. 73. Alright, you do it. We don't have enough money. Because I need to also stall both armies. Good, he's dead. Right, we need to also stall both of this group. Um, we could talk to Hojo for a minute. So, could you cancel your alliance? Uh, not with them. Cancel alliance with... What has brought you here today? How, how much would this cost? What would we need? Would, would 20 turns or indefinite? Oh. So there is a price. If we do indefinite, could you give me five turns? Because then we can cross into his land to fight him. Wait, if we have alliance, shouldn't I be able to walk through his land? But then why can't we all yeah, we can't offer this. I don't have much. I can offer a per turn amount. For like 20 turns. Okay, maybe we don't do the military access part. Maybe he even pays us. There's, there must, there must be a difference of payment here. I still need a bit of money. Yeah, he values are infinite. Okay, what can we do? What can we do? Um, thousand five hundred. Too much. Thousand two hundred. All right. Breaking up this alliance is going to open up the game for us, for sure. As long as we stay under 19 provinces, we shouldn't trigger Realm Divided. So is it just 36? 30, uh, okay. And that way we can kind of gauge... Wait, did I mess it up completely? Did, is it 26? No, it's 30-something. Or 30... I'm mumbling, but... It's, it's some value here. Could be the three. Nope, it's the two. We'll take it. Alright, now we can attack them. We can attack them. So what we're going to do is first freeze both. Should, should, should be something we can do. Nice. Let's just straight up declare, um, trespass. Let's just be polite about it. I am here. I don't want Hodra to get stronger. I don't want help. Uh, where's our fleet? They can't move. Look, do they have the node? They do. Decent fleet size. We don't want to take too much losses. We'll go with our main fleet. They can blockade this for now. They will be able to take this. Unfortunately, it's winter turn. We do take a little bit of winter attrition, but that's not a big deal. They're frozen here. We have this army. We have this army. Yeah, we cannot trespass. That is a thing. They're... Oh, they still might have military access agreements. That makes sense. We can go after those fleets that we saw earlier. Where did they go? Right, 
Right, this fleet is dead. We wanted to run once. So we can hunt it down together. Oh, cannot go together. We'll go solo then. Lost a ship, captured a ship. All good. Go back to repair. We might swing that fleet back. Take a peek. Where are they? They're going to start choking off our trade lines. Like, they're going to definitely do that. And there's not much we can do about it, because th this line just goes way too far. So we have to be prepared that we actually get zero income this turn. Maybe we increase tax. Yeah, we can definitely do it. It slows down growth, but... Very high. That's only a neutral. We'll make 6,000 next turn. Take away the trade. Ouch. But some of this trade is going north, so he can't choke off all of them. Yeah, we'll go with one tier higher for now. Actually, why don't we push it? If we're going to push it, what's the growth? How much growth are we sacrificing here? Minus 27, 13. So we're going to like lose our taxable base, which we've been building up. Um... Maybe not that high. Like with the global food of five, maybe we can neutralize it a little bit. Yeah, minus one. If we get a little bit more food, it wouldn't be too much of a problem. See, that's something we can accept. Um, let's continue. It's a bit unfortunate it just happened to be winter. If it was another season, it would be a little bit smoother here. I mean, if Hojo sees weakness and jump in, I wouldn't mind. Any sort of infighting would be great. Maybe Hojo will lose a lot of land, actually. Because I doubt their armies are back there. Oh. Uh, just went into the army. It's pointless. Alright, they have a fleet here. They lose this. But I definitely could retreat. Because we have another fleet right nearby. They're pulling back. They're, are they not raiding us? Ooh. He has finally died. We were expecting this for a while. Get them, uh... Cavalry units, maybe? Question mark? Wait. How did they... That's cheating. I know how they got here, because... Technically, they no longer have military access because the alliance broke, so they got kicked out, and the closest point when they got kicked out here is here. Which is ridiculous, because now they're like right next to us. Um, we can handle this. Let's see. Freeze him in place. Good. Freeze him in place. It didn't work. Just means we have to pay more money. Nope. Alright, so they can move. We hit this first. Easy take. They can come hit us, but they can't. We don't have much money, unfortunately. Alright, chase them away. Can we move any farther in? Alright, they're out at sea attritioning. Can we get to the point? Yes, we can. Not gonna be a lot of money because it's uh, war horses. Let's send the monks up. I'm tempted now. 38%? We'll keep trying. It's only 400. If we can incite a violence and then have them take it, that will be great. Don't 
Do I need to be here? Are there any dangerous ships nearby? I feel like other than the points, I can move this fleet up. I mean, we're giving up a choke point. I was chasing potentially a Takata ship somewhere. I don't see them anymore, so I guess we can go back. We know there's a fleet here. They're gonna flee. But how far can they go? Oh, they went here. Alright, we can make it, so they're dead. Alright, we ended up losing two, not capturing anyone. I can chase them off course, so they have to go perhaps get attritioned. This is full-fledged, we'll protect the line. They're missing two ships, and they're badly injured, go heal. We'll rotate them over. And we'll build them two new ships. Okay, so we have the inner seed pretty much cleansed. I don't see any ships by Hojo either. This is a bummer. Um, if they can give us military access, I can march over. Let's see. Be welcome, my friend. I have ordered sake prepared to wait yeah. out. I don't know what we can negotiate here with him for. Oh, he has declared war against Shogunit. So has Hojo. Oh, they're going after Kyoto. Okay, go for it. Uh, what are we doing? This is the final four stack, I believe. And then we have one, two, three, four, seven. We need to recruit three more. Or technically two more, and we can ship the army over. Give it to our brother. We can activate this group too. Ferry them. Against Hojo, basically. We can check here. 16 provinces, 17. That can be a new archery recruitment site. Oh, the roads are so bad. And then 18 here, 19 would make us right here. We don't want to get 19. I think Honki is actually as far as we should go because the way the road divide and we need to clean out all these targets before we can keep going deeper. There's there's still ships around, we need to find those ships, but uh, I think we're good here. If only Hojo and Takate would fight, it's likely, you know, given the alliance broke and that they're so intertwined. The relationship will take a while to kind of decrease, but uh, eventually I think they will fight. Especially if one of them takes the Shogunate. I doubt it's Takade at this point. Or Takada. Keep saying Takade, but... We get the point. Uh, they failed. Monk level up. They are raiding our ports. We're not going to upgrade that. Alright, we need to somehow kill both of this group. We should have enough movement to do so. He's gonna run. Then we're gonna run. I don't want to chase, actually. They're gonna be attritioning real hard here. We can pick off this small force. We make sure they don't move first. I think one of them went to go ambush. Oh no, they went back. Okay, if they went back, that's not too bad. I can ignore it. Small force, okay. He has to stay put. Failed. Yeah, the bouncing back to the edge of border, problematic for us. Okay, so he is staying put. 
We can drive this army out. Easy kills. We can... Oh, we don't have to fight it. It's so clean. We can just shoot them out, basically, with our range. Nice. Getting our Daimyo ranked up. Alright, it's under level, but at least we have all the choices in the world. He's popped out here as well. Movement. Um, I don't think we need to go down religious. We're not gonna go a C cavalry wedge formation for his cavalry. I'm not gonna put him in danger. What do we want? Maybe we just do want this. Yeah. We could save the point for later as well, but I think I'm fine using it. Uh, that is a force we can ignore. Keep them happy. We might have to tax break them. Unless we can get them over here. I mean, we have another turn to figure things out. Yeah, with another monk, I think we'll be fine. And plus, our army has to return because we have to deal with this nonsense. I can't get anyone through the lands. I haven't been able to incite a rebellion yet. What we're going to have to look at is whether this town's going to be happy enough without the monks. 12. So let's move out a few of them. Inciting on rest. That is our winner. Okay, you're gonna go here. Or is Aki better? 18%? No, this is better. Plus five now. They're also not happy once we move the army out, but maybe we can send one monk and take care of it. Alright, you guys go back. You need to be by yourself now to make sure we don't cause any problems with the uh, eyes for the ladies. Self-centered? Uh, not too bad. He's going to have to wait till like there's an opportunity to attack. That's basically what he has to do. I can't afford anything else. I'll give them a cavalry unit. They need one unit. They made it. Uh, we are three units, two units away, three units. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We want nine, right? Because we want to get him a slot. We can't even do eight. We can only just do one because that's all the money we have left anyways. Yeah, and then we can get him plus like a ninja or maybe a cavalry unit, something like that. Yeah, we're just out of cash now. We'll just keep chasing them off. I don't think there's anything down here that's causing problems. Yeah, I want to repair here because that's also where we're going to get the new recruitments in. We'll switch with them. Surprisingly, we're not getting raided deep. Like, they could raid us there. But they're not. I don't think there's any enemy ships here. This is slightly injured, not worth going back to fix. Alright, let's continue. I mean, so far that war has gone as good as it can be. None of the ship slipped by, all the ship that, you know, came forward got picked off, we got their node. They have a northern node as well. Like, if we're confident in our navy abilities, we can't be. Like, we need ports. We can't just keep pushing it forward. Alright, now we gotta go hit that guy. Ah, peace deal. I offer this. Peace. A simple end to war before our peoples are gone. Like blossom on the breeze. 
I actually might take this. We got their node. We got the two pieces of land I wanted. The next war should be against Hodro, not them. And if they can pay us a handsome amount and not block our trade ports, this will be lovely. Alright, let's do small number first. Let's see how far apart we are. Ah, very far apart. Okay. A uh, thousand. What if we sell them also an infinite military access? How much money can I get for that? Yeah, we're at a very awkward stage because I don't want to take any more land going forward. Honky is where we want to defend. See what I mean? All right, we're not getting anything. We're not getting anything. It's, it's the one coin. Nope, not even one coin. Don't trade with them. <laughs> okay, all right, we'll take the trade. We'll take the peace deal. Your word. That way their daimyo gets out safely. We don't have to go back and take care of it. Foreign prosperity. Excellent. So we get a couple turns to kind of neutralize all the areas that we picked up and prepare for the hit against Hodro, essentially. Uh, we are allied with them. We're going to break a lot of words when we do that. But that's, that's fine because we're going to pick up our 19 provinces and we're going to trigger Rom Divided anyways. We could keep them out and keep pushing forward, but we'll just get overextended. Our North Coast Naval Blockade can start here now with the port to support. And obviously we'll continue to push forward in the future, but we'll have a kind of place to kind of divide. I don't have to incite violence here. I can just have this army ready to take this at a moment's notice. Army to take this. Army to take this. I'm building a new stack there. I'll ship them back, give it to my brother, have him strike out at Bitru. So we'll land at these three. Actually, no, he can take Bison. And then basically he, the army can move forward one. He can move forward one. Setsu also has a port. We have to kind of cut that off. And then they can just hold here. If we take Setsu and everything here, then all the navy is going to come this way. We can put like maybe four ship groups here. To kind of just stall everyone from getting over here and then everything will be safe. We have three stacks here to take this, build out our trade fleet, capture both nodes, and kind of go from there. So we're set up pretty nicely. Uh, the next you know, thing is going to be just kind of attacking Hodro. We'll, we'll take a few turns to kind of swallow up what we had. We got to build out these locations, a couple new recruitment sites, one here for cavalry. And then we got Hoki, which is a good one for archers. So that's going to speed up our uh, recruitment for our faction, especially since our Daimyu's army kind of sacrificed a bit. We'll see how things go. And we're not going to build it all the way up. It's going to take forever. So just a decent amount would be good. And we'll go from there. So until next time, bye.